Everyone has their day. Sometimes when watching children taking their swings or throwing with still underdeveloped arms, the more seasoned visitors to the field might envy their youth and the fact that their best days are still ahead of them. Other visitors may not have swung a bat in years and said goodbye to their optimal playing weights years ago. They might bemoan the fact that their best days are behind them. There was a man who strolled to the plate bat in hand on a sunny August afternoon. As is normally the case when a batter is over the age of 10, he asked the pitcher to throw from the rubber, the regulation 60-foot, 6-inch length. The first two pitches came in straight and with just enough mustard to make it across the plate. They resulted in two swings and misses and an 0-2 count. Naturally, the count didn't really matter to anyone watching the action, but surely the batter knew he was in a sizable hole and could feel everyone's gaze. The third pitch must have perfectly crossed into the batter's box at just the right time, as the sweet sound of wood meeting ball was heard across the movie site. After an estimated 16 or so hops, this heat-seeking missile, as the batter will undoubtedly recall it, made its way into center field as the batter hustled to first base. As the pitcher held the ball and looked over to the batter, now bent over trying to find his breath on first base, the batter lipped a single word to the pitcher. Thanks. In the batter's mind, he had won the only game he came to play. Undoubtedly, this would be a day he would never forget.